What is up, everybody? This is Brock Kunuko, Optimum Nutrition and ABB Sponsored Athlete. Just coming to you to make another video um, in regards to nutrition this time. Want to talk a little bit about uh, my my nighttime meals, the meal I take in before bed. Um, been getting a lot of questions from people in regards to the types of food I'm eating before bed. Uh, so this is something that I, I take in roughly all year round pretty much, um, even in my off season as well as pre-contest. It's just kind of altered a little bit depending on what time of year it is. But uh, this is something that I eat in order to uh, keep my muscles anabolic basically till I get my next meal, which would be when I wake up in the morning. So um, check this out, guys, and then uh, apply it to yourself and hopefully get some good results doing it. Here we go. Alrighty, so what we're going to be making here, um, it's going to be an egg meal. It's going to be basically made up of eggs, turkey, um, some cheese, bread, and uh, milk. So um, anyways, here's I'm going to show you some of the uh, ingredients into all this whole thing while the pan's heating up. Um, so this is the turkey I use. It's uh, just ground turkey. I usually use this in the free contest versus off season. Right now I'm in my off season, so um, I'd use a different turkey, but they don't have it in stock at the store, so I had to pick this up. This is what the packaging looks like to it. It's really lean. I don't know if you can see that. It says 93% lean, 7% fat. It's just ground turkey. And uh, I don't really measure out my portions so much right now, simply for the fact I'm in my off season again. So. That's not a super big issue for me. Kind of neat. I kind of know what I what I should be taking in right now. It gets more important to measure the stuff out once I actually um, reach contest prep. Then I got my eggs, just basic normal eggs. You know, nothing, nothing special there. So, um, so anyway, let's get started on cooking this stuff up. So what I'm gonna do? Spray that down with olive oil. Gonna probably take about this much of the turkey, one quarter of it, about a slice that big. Plop that in there. Get that cooking. All right, guys. So the turkey is just about done. Check it out. What it looks like. Brown it up and throw up my Tupperware so I, I can cook my eggs. So I uh, dump this in there. And that is the turkey. So we got that in Tupperware. Next, we gotta cook the eggs up. So, what we're gonna do next is uh, spray this down one more time. Start cooking the eggs. those up. Now some of the spices I use on my eggs, just like I did for the meat, I'll use a uh, mustache, chicken seasoning, sodium free. I use the same stuff on the turkey that I just grilled up. So again, um, off season, I don't really watch my, um, my levels as far as my sodium so much. I mean, I still watch them, but not nearly as much as I do when I'm contest prep. So I look at, you know, the different seasons and everything like that when I'm more in contest prep. But right now, I could pretty much use anything I want. So um, I just kind of stick to the basics, though. I use a lot of mustache just because it tastes good and it's low in sodium. It keeps me a little leaner in my off-season, so I'll use that. I'll sprinkle that on the eggs. Let this cook up for a couple seconds. And then normally what I would be doing right now 
is um, throwing in my bread. So I just use uh, this split top wheat for right now. Again, in the off season, I'm not as strict. So what I'm going to do here, flip that egg. Flip those up for a second. Alright, so the eggs are pretty much done. Got them on the plate here. Take a look. So those are done. Um, the way I cook mine is, has the yellow yolk in the middle still. So if I pop that open, all that stuff would flow out of there. What I'm going to do here now is put a little cheese on it. This is my off season again, so I normally wouldn't be using this when I'm in my contest prep. But again, I kind of can be allowed to take this in right now, simply for the fact that I'm not prepping as much as I, you know, need to be right now. So, um, then after that, I'm going to add the turkey on top of that. The turkey's on there. And then, to finish that off, I'm going to go over to my fridge here. Grab my favorite hot sauce. Sriracha. It's good stuff. Especially on eggs. So um, what I'm going to do here is just put a little of that on my egg meal. There you go. And that's pretty much my egg meal besides my bread I gotta throw my bread on there which will be done any second here but um that's ma that's basically my every single day or every night I should say I usually eat that uh, before bed now just to show you guys that I'm not you know lying to you it's uh 1.17 a.m. 16 so it's about 1.15 in the morning right now, and uh, I'm pretty tired, I'm ready for bed, but you know, I gotta get it in and I gotta, gotta make, make these sacrifices on a daily basis in order to achieve what I wanna achieve, you know, this is, this is what makes you stand out and become something, uh, something better than, you know, all the other things out there. If you wanna strive and reach for your goals, you gotta, you gotta go beyond what normal is so it's 1 a.m. finishing up my last meal of the day um, gonna eat that and uh, probably crash get some sleep um, and just to touch base a little bit on this um, off-season versus contest prep I use all these same ingredients or you know basically the staple foods I, I eat these same things before bed even if I'm in contest prep the only difference is obviously I alter you know the fat intake, uh, the sodium intake, um, and that sort of thing, and the carb intake from carb loading, carb depleting. You know all that kind of stuff is altered, but I still have the basic foundations of what I use. Which you know, for the example being, if this was my contest prep meal, I'd be eating. Uh, you know, I wouldn't be having the cheese. I'd be you know eating this lean turkey. You know, and not not substituting it for some kind of you know generic kind. I'd try to be getting the better the better cuts and that sort of thing. Um, I'd watch my sodium intake, so I probably wouldn't have the hot sauce on it. Probably wouldn't be eating the bread. You know, I'm gonna have a glass of milk with this too. So I would cut that out as well. So you know, it's just it's just a matter of having, I guess, the basic foundation of all these different foods put together and altering them accordingly as you go along and and altering it to your body and your results, tailoring it to yourself in order for you to achieve those results so anyway that's it hope you guys got some good insight on what I do and uh, just a little glimpse on a meal that I like to eat before bed to keep my size keep me full and keep my muscle growing until the next time 
I wake up and get my meal in in the morning. Thanks for checking it out, guys. Remember to check out bmcfitness.net to get your meal plan made up and get you on your way to the results you deserve. Thanks again for checking out. Peace.